In this example, we are being asked to rationalize the numerator of this rational expression. Now, in order to rationalize this numerator, we're going to need to multiply both the numerator and denominator by the conjugate of the numerator. Now, the reason that we're multiplying the numerator and denominator by the conjugate of our numerator is that ultimately we want to get rid of these square roots. So in order to do that, if we multiply by the conjugate, we're going to produce a difference of squares. So we can think about our numerator here as the binomial a minus b over h. So the conjugate of a minus b is going to be a plus b. Now, we can recall that the product of conjugates produces the difference of squares formula, but let's verify it for ourselves by multiplying these terms out. So in foiling this product of conjugates out, we can see our two middle terms are canceling each other out to zero. And then notice on the outer terms, the first term and the last term, we have the square of the square root. So those are going to be canceled out. And we have a final simplification. So our x's cancel out, leaving us with just an h in the numerator and denominator. So those h's cancel out, and we're left with the rational expression 1 by the square root of x plus h plus the square root of x.